Hey you guys, how's it going? It's Pine Tunnel Peas. Thank God I got that in time. Hermione! How are you feeling? A lot better now, thanks. I'm really disappointed. With all that's happened, Professor McGonagall has cancelled this year's exams. I was really looking forward to doing all of that revision. As you can see, Harry, Hermione's made a complete recovery. Yeah, just a bit, eh? <laughs> anyway, did you know that the House Cup is about to be awarded? The presentation's in the Great Hall. Yeah. I hope we've got enough house points to Oh my god. I'd really love to see Malfoy's face and we managed to do it two years in a row. Just look at your right. Like, just look to your right. Like, honestly, it's so bad. Like, holy crap. But, uh, yeah, I think, hey guys, how's it going? Uh, welcome to the fucking, oh, sorry about my language right there, but, um, this is the final part, man. This is it. The final part of Chamber of Secrets. Enjoy the final cutscene. We come to the end of the most eventful year at Hogwarts. And so, for their many achievements and outstanding commitment to the school, it is with great pleasure that I present the House Cup to Gryffindor. Yeah! Woo Sorry guys, just felt like the moment. <laughs> just had to do it. Alright, so we're going to go to Dumbledore's office. we got one more final, final cutscene. Sorry about that noise, by the way. Let's see what he has to say. Oh, man. This is it, guys. Freaking season finale. Well, P finale. Whatever. Same thing. Jenny! Harry told them everything. For nearly a quarter of an hour, he spoke into the rapt silence. He told them about hearing the disembodied voice. How Hermione had finally realized that he was hearing a basilisk in the pipes. How he and Ron, following a hint from Hagrid, had followed the spiders into the forest. That Aragog had told them where the last victim of the basilisk, 50 years before, had died. How he had guessed that Moaning Myrtle had been the victim, and that the entrance to the basilisk's lair, the Chamber of Secrets, might be in her bathroom. Yeah, boy. Sorry about that noise yet again. But how did you all get out of there alive? Well, Jesus. it had a lot to do with loyalty and friendship. And courage. <laughs> Harry, you can't forget that. Yes, and courage too. Yep. Professor Dumbledore explained that 50 years ago, Lord Voldemort, as the 16-year-old Tom Riddle, had enchanted his diary. And that diary had enchanted Jimmy. Too bad there's no Dobby in this game. For it was Lucius Malfoy who had planted Tom Riddle's diary on the hapless Ginny Weasley. And, as for Harry, well, once again, he truly was the boy who lived. Yep, that is a true story, and it will also the end of the LP. Yeah, buddy. Alright guys, um, I will see you guys in a second for my LP review. Hey guys, how's it going? Well, it is that time of the LP again. And uh, we have finished Chamber of Secrets, which I was tweeting about earlier while I was in class. Yeah, that was not fun. Anyways, um, LP review of this. Um, the LP actually went very smooth. Um, it went really well. Um, obviously, Chamber of Secrets, I've done it before. And the game's just hella fun. So, um, but yeah, anyways, out of like Starwise and stuff, um, I'd probably give it probably about a 4 out of 5. Uh, stars. Um, it's very good. The, the gameplay is very solid. Uh, there's a couple key points in the thing I think they shouldn't have left out, but they did, which is a little bit unfortunate, but whatever. It happens, right? So, But uh, as you guys are watching this, um, I got my 100 subscriber finally, which is awesome, and uh, I'm really proud of it, and uh, it's taken me a long time, but I'm finally there. So, yeah, it's awesome. Anyways, guys, um... Thanks very much for watching. If any of you guys actually have um, a request for my next game, uh, feel free to post on the bottom of this, because we're coming up to the closing of my remake game, so it'll be all brand new ones now, which is going to be awesome. But, uh, yeah, just throw a message down below um, if you guys on a certain game you guys like to see. But uh, one game that I am guaranteed I am going to be starting pretty soon, because I put it on order yesterday, and it got shipped out yesterday, so I'm guessing in about a week I'll be starting Goblet of Fire. And uh, that will be the LP after Deathly Hollows. 
So I'm not really not sure. I'm, I might start something tomorrow. I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I'm just going to figure it out, and we'll just go from there. But uh, anyways, guys, thanks for watching like always. Um, hope you really enjoyed the LP. I had a lot of time recording it. But uh, yeah, thanks, guys, and I'll see you guys later.